<laughs> What's up my nabooers? I know that I've been a little quiet on features. Summer's upon us. That means I have some fish to catch, some beers to drink, and I will occasionally release something because there's been features that I've been working on um, that are incomplete. This is one of them that I think you guys are gonna like because there's been a little bit of chatter on the forum, people asking how to copy files, etc. Well, first thing, when you boot up Cloud CPM and you type in help because it tells you to do so if you don't know what you're doing, then you'll see here that uh, there's all the commands like Cloud GUI, that's a graphical way to copy files. RNCMD, that can copy files between the computer and uh, the NABU as well. But then I also added this new one called CPM Drive. So let's just type in CPM Drive. And I'll show you what this thing's all about. So this will build a drive, the D drive, based upon the D directory of your Retronet store folder. That means when you go to your internet adapter and you click on settings, and you go to your Retronet, you have a folder here. Now this folder is what contains all of your personal files. This is all your stuff that you want to be exposed to the NABU. So let's go take a look at what that looks like. I already have a shortcut here to get to it. When you first load this up, what you're gonna end up with is a drive called, or a directory called D. This D drive contains user areas, 16 of them, and you can put files in here. So whatever files you put inside of these folders, will magically appear on your D drive in NABU. Let's take a little look by actually showing you how it works. So I'll jump into Cloud CPM here on the nabu.ca website. I'll scroll down, scroll down, scroll down, scroll down. And what I'm gonna look for is a little section here called, ah, get more CPM software. So the Retro Archive um, seems like it's the most popular. It's got lots of stuff. So let's find something here. Let's see, we got some games entertainment software. Sounds good. Sargon, all right, let's take it. Oh, of course it's not commonly downloaded. This is uh, Microsoft's way of making sure that our <laughs> downloaded NABU files, CPM files from 1984 don't give us viruses. Saddle down, Microsoft. Okay, so we'll extract our Sar Sargon here. And we have our file. So what I'm just gonna do is I'm gonna place it into user area three just for fun. Why not? And I'm gonna move it into here. There. So let's go back to our NABU. And I'm just gonna type in CPM drive B for build. And what that's gonna do is that's gonna take all the files that are inside of that D drive, that D directory and all the user areas, and it's gonna build a drive. So now when I go to D drive, and of course we put it into user area three, so let's switch over to user area three, DIR, there we go, and there's our Sargon. We can run it, and here's our little Sargon chess. I think it's text-based chess. <laughs> so I was originally gonna make it so that these files would be updated in real time, However, the issue was is that because the way the CPM file system or well, any file system works essentially is that if any file was added to this directory structure, then that changes um, the file location where everything's stored inside of the physical disk. And then that would have caused a bunch of issues if you copied a file while a program was running or in between um, disk activities, etc. So I just made it so that you can just refresh and rebuild the disk by command line. I think. That just works fine. So you just add all your files into this here and then just um, run that CPM drive command and well, that's it. If you're ever wondering about different utilities and software for the NABU, specifically Cloud CPM, there is a software tab on nabu.ca, which I recommend you give it a little clicky click and a little read through. So if you scroll through here, you'll find there's tons and tons and tons of different programs that I've written for the NABU that solve pretty much every problem. So if you wanna know like how it works, most of these uh, utilities have videos associated with them, just like the RNCMD. And of course, I will add this uh, CPM drive to it as well. All right, everyone, I'll see you online. Come to the NABU forum and uh, talk about your NABU experiences and your NABU stuff. And I'll see you in the next video.